Good afternoon to Gurdjieff, Prasad here. It's my great privilege to invite you all to this cancer awareness session hosted by the Department of Clinical Nutrition and Diabetes, the Women's Development Center of College and Center for Women's Cancer Care. It's an honor and a to welcome Dr. Ashwin Matthew, Consultant Medical Oncologist, Center for Women's Cancer Care, our first person who will deliver the keynote address. I am pleased to welcome our respective promotions to PA Manager, Rev. Dr. Sister Vita C. S. S. T., our Beyond Narrator, Sister Emily C. S. T., Principal Dr. Alfred Sir Vijay Joseph, Senior Administrator of College, Dr. Sajimura Hansi, in their absence here. I would also welcome Dr. Lega Sinua, Women's Studies Center Coordinator, who has always been our support and strength. I also welcome Sunya Yukotaru, HOD Clinical Nutrition Diabetes Department. In their absence, I welcome other faculty members, women, teachers, and students. We all know cancer is a global disease, especially in India, and is spreading rapidly. The effects of cancer in a person's physical health directly influences mental health status, but awareness is yet poor among the general population. By hearing the word cancer, we have the feelings of sadness fear and helplessness. Courage conquers all things. It even gives strength to the body, once in time of cases. Advancements in the field of medicine have already been tested with human determination, creativity, and the inner desire to live and improve lives. It will be that it will be a delight to hear from Dr. Ajo Matthew, a resource person, as he shares his insights. We are sure that each participant will leave the awareness session richer in knowledge and more connected to their views and safety standards. With immense pleasure, I want to have the students and faculty in the Nutrition Dynamics Department. Welcome all the participants to this awareness session. Let the session be a beacon of hope and platform for sharing the current system. Thank you. Uh, it's so good to be here. It was my long cherished dream to enter the gates of St. Teresa's College. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry I was late. Uh, but tell me more about all of you. How many of you are uh, clinical nutrition students? And bachelors or masters? Bachelors. Bachelors. What year? First year. All of you are first year. So where did you start? <coughs> April, 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 March, or March. <laughs> July of 2023. Okay. So you have completed eight months, nine months of clinical education. Okay. In a very early class of life, princesses. Very uh, department of that. Software developer. Software developer. Okay, and you are here because you are part of the men's cell. And you are also bachelor's software developer. Oh no. Alright, so it's a mixed group in one day. Some of you are richness, some of you are future software developers. Okay. So, you know, I'm coming here mainly to talk to you about cancer, some of the myths that are associated with cancer, um, you know, how we can clarify the myths, how we can learn together, how we can understand uh, the field and where it's going. So, I'll give you a brief overview. So, I'll tell you, is Marshall and Krishna, Mariana and Krishna? Huh? Like, is it Mariana? So, if you don't have any Malayalam, you don't have any Malayalam? Yes. Oh, 100% Malayalam. Okay. Let me see you. Let me see you. Okay, so. In this uh, session, a brief session, I don't plan to prolong this to a very big uh, PowerPoint lecture. I'll just give you an overview about the answer. And then I'll open the floor to your questions. I'm sure you may have questions. So, like, Malayalam. Out of all the kids here, sorry I called you kids, all the, all the students sitting here, how many of you have had to deal with cancer in a family friend, in a family member, loved one, or in some capacity, somebody you know having cancer? Can you raise your hands? Friends are there alone. I think you family, I like it friends, I like it family, friends, I like it. Arkinkle the cancer on the blood of the way of death. Wow. You see, almost everybody has some exposure to cancer, right? And 
And the problem with cancer is it's not just an individual disease. It's a social disease. It's a problem of the society. Why? Because as the disease affects an individual, it burdens the family, it burdens the society, because there are a lot of implications. Especially when a young person has cancer, his wife becomes a widow, his children become fatherless, or rather have to stop going to school soon and go to work, you know, early labor, uh, and financial settings end up costing a lot of their money, have to quit education. So a lot of these social problems happen. And as the years go by, Kerala is going to see a lot more cancer patients than they have ever experienced. Do you know the reason for that? Do you know the reason why as years go by, uh, we will have more cancer patients in Kerala? Lifestyle. Lifestyle, okay. But what is the most important reason why there will be more cancer patients? In Kerala, compared to Bihar, exactly. Ours is an aging society. When I was stepping into St. Francis College, I just saw a notice. Um, heavenly mansions. You know that you Heavenly mansions. You know that you very well known. Heavenly mansions saw a notice. Heavenly. As a citizen in the main campus, rather than very kind of heavenly mansion, senior citizens' home. Kerala is a very powerful age of the Sadhana Dharma, the Holy Sadhana Dharma period. We are an aging society, it's an elderly population, aging society. And when a society ages, the number of cancer patients increases. Why? Because cancer is mainly a disease of the elderly. What are you thinking? But it happens in youngsters too, right? Yes, it does. But primarily cancer impacts the elderly, most importantly. So that is one of the most important reasons cancers are rising in Canada, because we are an aging society. And as other societies start aging, the number of patients with cancer will increase there also. The second important reason is lifestyle. What is the lifestyle that you're talking about? Can you give me some examples? What are Smoking, excellent. Tobacco use. Tobacco use is a very, very bad uh, lifestyle contributor for increased cancer incidence. Very, very bad. What else? Sedentary life. How? How does sedentary life cost them? Yeah, I'm going to job or I'm sedentary. Exercise is yeah. like exercise is like a lot of obesity. And obesity creates a lot of hormonal imbalance in the body. And hormonal imbalance ends up with risk factors for cancer. So sedentary lifestyle will talk about that, lack of exercise. And sedentary lifestyle will have a problem on more stress. People with sedentary lifestyle, computer professionals and their stress are. They end up with more stress. Most stress will be with him. Stress eating way. I'm not getting money from the depression. Stress will be with him. Start eating, eating. Start eating. Start eating. Stress will be with him. It's bad. Stress may not directly cause cancer, but stress causes a lot of these problems that puts you at risk for cancer. So what is the other lifestyle problem that causes cancer? Alcohol use. Any amount of alcohol can put you at risk for cancer. So smoking, alcohol, unhealthy lifestyle. Unhealthy lifestyle for me is a bad diet. Bad diet is a nutrition diet. Bad diet is a what is bad diet? You know, you know what is it? Bad diet is a healthy diet. What is a healthy diet? You know, I like to pick on flyer. Pick it on a diet. You know, it's a diet. 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 Okay, yeah. Ah, yes. Sorry. I have a fondness for black men. It's a nutrition like black men. A photo is softer than this. It was a softer than this. Ah, okay. But I'm very 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 Thank you. 
bring this to your vitamin deficiency will go. So here we have a value. Low sugar promises. Anything that says low sugar promises to your vitamin, there may be a red flag because they will be adding the sugar with artificial sweeteners. Instant and flavored varieties. Instant sarah. Uh, yogurt. So, processing And uh, when in doubt, this is the last point. When in doubt, look at the ingredient label and ask yourself whether you can make it at home. Ultra processed food contains additives that are not typically used in home kitchen. So, anyway, so ultra processed food, processed food, but I tend to put this on the one thing on the other one. So, you can see the components of the food. You can see the components Average 
ഹെച്ച്പിക്കെതിരെ വാക്സിൻ എടുക്കണം ഇവർക്ക് എല്ലാവർക്കും ഹൺഡ്രഡ് പെർസെന്റ് സെർവിക്കൽ ക്യാൻസർ വരാതിരിക്കാനുള്ള വഴിയത് മനസ്സിലായി ഇരുപത്തഞ്ച് വയസ്സിൽ മുകളിലാൻ എന്ത് ചെയ്യണം ചെയ്യണം ഡോക്ടേഴ്സില്ല നിർബന്ധമായിട്ടും ചെറുപ്പക്കാരനെ നഷ്ടപ്പെട്ടു ഇങ്ങനത്തെ What is the most common cancer in women? Breast cancer. Very good. Can breast cancer be uh, cured? What percentage of breast cancers can be cured? Upwards of 85%. So, 85 to 90% of breast cancers can be cured. Provided it is diagnosed early. It's very important. It's diagnosed early. So, what can you do to help a doctor diagnose cancers early? So you have to be aware of your body, right? You have to be aware of your body. If you notice any changes in your breast, it could be a lung, it could be any change in shape of the liquid, it could be a discharge from the breast. In the end of the year, you can see that the breast is a part of the breast. You can see that the breast is a part of the breast. You can see that the breast is a part of the breast. You can see that the breast is a part of the breast. You can see that the breast is a part of the breast. You can see that the breast is a part of the breast. ിലാതെ <laughs> 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 എന്റെ പ്രാക്ടീസിലുള്ള ഏറ്റവും യങ്ങസ്റ്റ് ബ്രസ്റ്റ് ക്യാൻസർ പേഷ്യന്റ് ട്വന്റി ത്രീ ഇയേഴ്സ് എനിക്ക് ആക്ച്വലി നയൻറ്റീൻ ഇയർ ഓൾഡ് മെഡിക്കൽ സ്റ്റുഡൻറ്റ് ബ്രസ്റ്റ് ക്യാൻസർ പേഷ്യൻ്റ് സോ ബ്രസ്റ്റ് ക്യാൻസറിൻ്റെ ഏജ് ഒന്നും ഇല്ല ഇന്ത്യ പോലുള്ള സ്ഥലത്ത് ചെറുപ്പക്കാർക്ക് ക്യാൻസർ വരാറുണ്ട് നൂറ് സ്ത്രീകളുണ്ടെങ്കിൽ എത്ര പേർക്ക് ബ്രസ്റ്റ് ക്യാൻസർ വരും അവരുടെ ലൈഫ് ടൈമിൽ ഔട്ട് ഓഫ് ഹൺഡ്രഡ് വിമൻ ഹൗ മെനി ഗുഡ് ഹാവ് ബ്രസ്റ്റ് ക്യാൻസർ ഇൻ ദ ലൈഫ് ടൈം ലൈഫ് ടൈം പറഞ്ഞാൽ എൺപത്തഞ്ച് വയസ്സ് വരെ അല്ലെങ്കിൽ തൊണ്ണൂറ് വയസ്സ് വരെ Um, 10. Nearly 10. Good, I just see you over there. 
What do you think? Vishu Sikha Lata? Vishu Sikha Lata is like, our boy to the other person, like, our mommy. I need an example, right? This is one. This is one of the things that actually got the treatment to cut it up. So, breast cancer is one of them. This is one of the things that you have to do with your face. If you have to do it, you have to do it with your face. That's how you treat it. This is a very important patient. You have to do it with your cancer. You have to do it with your face. You have to do it with your type of lymphoma, leukemia, CLA, and you have to do it with your face. Now, you have to do it with your face. You have to do it with your face. But if you don't have to treat the patient, the doctor will tell you that you don't have to treat the patient. If you don't have to treat the patient, you don't have to treat the patient. If you don't have to treat the patient, you don't have to treat the patient. If you don't have to treat the patient, you don't have to treat the patient. But there is a miscommunication problem, there is a delivery fraud committed on you. So anything that is too good to believe, too good to be true, we are not believing. Yes, Ona. Ah, Ona. 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 Study is a proof of it. That's why it's a refined attitude. 
ഇതിന്റെ പ്രശ്നം എന്താണെന്നറിയോ ആയുർവേദം ക്യൂറി എന്ന് പറയുന്നതിന്റെ പ്രോബ്ലം പലപ്പോഴും പ്രൂവ് പ്രൂവൺ തെറാപ്പി ചെയ്യാൻ പേഷ്യൻസ് ഇന്നലെ കാണുന്നു എങ്ങനെ ധാരാളം രോഗികൾ മരണപ്പെടാനുള്ള കാര്യം ഇങ്ങനെയുള്ള തെറ്റിദ്ധാരണകൾ കാരണമാണ് അപ്പൊ ഞാൻ ആയുർവേദത്തിനെതിരല്ല പക്ഷെ എങ്കിൽ ഐ സ്റ്റാൻഡ് ഫോർ സം മെഡിക്കൽ ടെക്നിക്സ് പ്രൂവൺ അപ്പൊ ആയുർവേദത്തിൽ ഉപയോഗിക്കുന്ന പല മരുന്നുകളും അത് റിഫൈൻ ചെയ്ത് കോൺസെൻട്രേറ്റ് ചെയ്ത് പ്യൂരിഫൈ ചെയ്ത് ഉപയോഗിച്ച ഗുണമാണ് ടെർമറിക്ക് ടെർമറിക്ക് എല്ലാവർക്കും ഉപയോഗിച്ച് അടിപൊളിയാണല്ലേ പറഞ്ഞത് ആന്റി ഇൻഫ്ലമേറ്ററി എല്ലാം എന്നിട്ട് ടെർമറിക്ക് കൊണ്ട് ഉണ്ടാക്കിയിട്ട് ഒരു സാധനം കൊണ്ട് ഇതുവരെ ഒരു മനുഷ്യനും കൂടെ പിടിക്കില്ല ലാർജ് ക്ലിനിക്കൽ ഡ്രൈവ് മില്യൻസ് ഓഫ് ഡോളേഴ്സ് യൂസ് ചെയ്യുന്നുണ്ട് ടെർമറിക്കിന്റെ ബെനിഫിഷ്യൽ എഫക്റ്റ് കണ്ടുപിടിക്കാൻ പോയിന്റ് ഇല്ല കാരണം ടെർമറിക്ക് മനുഷ്യന്റെ ബോഡി സിസ്റ്റത്തിൽ വ്യത്യാസം ഉണ്ടാക്കണം എങ്കിൽ യൂസ് ചെയ്യുന്ന ടെർമറിക്ക് ട്രക്ക് ലോഡാണ് ഈ ട്രക്കോട് ടെർമറിക്ക് ഇങ്ങനെ മനുഷ്യൻ കൊടുക്കാൻ പറ്റും കൊടുത്താലും അതിന്റെ സൈഡ് എഫക്ട്സ് ഉണ്ടാകും അപ്പൊ ഇതെല്ലാം റിഫൈൻ ചെയ്ത് ഉപയോഗിക്കണം അപ്പൊ ഞാൻ പറഞ്ഞ കേസ് വൈദ്യന്മാർ പ്രത്യേകിച്ച് നാട്ടുമരുന്നുകൾ ഉപയോഗിക്കുന്ന ആളുകൾക്ക് ഒത്തിരി തെറ്റിദ്ധാരണകളാണ് എനിക്കൊരു ധാരാളം രോഗികൾ മരണപ്പെട്ടിട്ടുണ്ട് ആയുർവേദത്തിന് ഞാൻ എഗ്രി ചെയ്യാറുണ്ടോ ഉണ്ട് പ്രൂവൺ തെറാപ്പി ഇല്ലാത്ത കേസസ് ചില പേഷ്യൻസിന് എടുത്തു എന്ന് പറയും ഡോക്ടർ വീടോട് അവർ പ്രൂവൺ തെറാപ്പി അവൈലബിൾ അല്ല സ്റ്റേജ് ഫോർ ആയി നീ എന്ത് ചെയ്യണം അങ്ങനെയുള്ള കോൺടെക്സ്റ്റിൽ ഇഷ്യൂ ഇപ്പോൾ ഏറെ പോയിക്കോട്ടെ ജീവിതം നമ്മൾ പോയിക്കോ ഇന്റഗ്രേറ്റീവ് മെഡിസിൻ ആസ്പെക്റ്റേറ്റീവ് കൂട്ടാനായിട്ട് ചെയ്യണം എന്നുള്ളതിന് ചെയ്യും കുഴപ്പമില്ല പക്ഷെ പ്രോബ്ലം എന്താ പറഞ്ഞാൽ ഈ ആയുർവേദ മെഡിസിൻസിൽ അതിന്റെ കുറേ അഡിക്റ്റീവ്സ് ഉണ്ട് അതായത് ഏത് ടെൻഷൻ തോന്നുന്നു എന്തൊക്കെയാണ് ഇതെല്ലാം ഇന്ററാക്ട് ചെയ്യും പ്രൂവൺ ട്രീറ്റ്മെന്റ് ആയിട്ട് അങ്ങനെ പ്രൂവൺ ട്രീറ്റ്മെന്റ് എഫക്റ്റീവ് ആയി സോ അതുകൊണ്ട് ആയിരുന്നു മിക്സ് ചെയ്തത് എപ്പോഴും പറയും ഐ ഡോ നോ സിംഗിൾ ക്യാൻസർ ആയുർവേദിക്ക് ഇറ്റ്സ് നോട്ട് ഗുഡ് ഫോർ ദ ലിവർ 
and you can see there is a lot of kidney cases in the world. And I myself have seen a lot of patients who develop uh, you know, kidney failure because they have been on chronic medicines through IVF. Because there are heavy metals in it. So short duration. So you need to study here. Yeah. Yes. Question number two. Um, so when it comes to genetics, or it, um, how prevalent is it? Family with cancer and Yes. Out of every hundred uh, cancers in women, I think around five could be hereditary. So for a family can multiple uh, generations of cancer contribute to other uh, genetic karma on the test is test is not available. 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 Test is